So, internet, reviewing today Deep Cool's AK500. And if you watched our channel before, hindi na to bago, very familiar, because we've also reviewed the AK400 and the Big Daddy, the AK620. So, nandito tayo ngayon, may AK500. Ano ba yung pagkaiba nila sa uh, tatlong models? Well, the similarities first, they all sport Deep Cool's Matrix style towers. I call them Matrix style, but basically the checkerboard design. Not too sure about the engineering, but I think this allows Deep Cool to pack in in a tighter space, kumbaga mas dense yung towers nila. So that increases the surface area of the overall tower, allowing it to radiate heat more quickly. So si Deep Cool lang may ganito na checkerboard design that we've seen, but it's consistent throughout their new coolers from their AK line, which is the more premium line, also to their AG line na papalit sa Gamak series nila, naka checkerboard design din sila. The AK400 is the smallest, very similar to the AK500. When you put them side by side, parang half the size lang nung tower nung 400 si 500. And we'll see later on kung kamusta ba performance nun. Doubling the size of a single tower, how much better performance do you get? Of course, the original dito sa line na to, yung AK620, which is a two tower, two fan, big boy cooler. Si AK500, medyo big boy na din siya. Yung height niya, 158mm, which is a bit tall. Yung mga big boy coolers, mga 160 pataas. So, 158 is not the tallest, pero medyo matangkad na rin siya. Be sure to check your case kung kasha ba siya dun sa case mo. So, the AK500 is a single tower, single fan cooler with six heat pipes. Yung benchmark natin is the AMD stock cooler, which to be fair, is not bad as stock coolers go. Kinalaban namin yung AK500 against the stock since if you're interested in this size of one tower cooler, usually it's because you want to replace the stock but don't want to spend too much. Our testing setup was a Ryzen 5 2600 which is a mid-level CPU and heat generator. Again, keeping with the more likely user setups that will use the AK500. Pinatakpo namin yung CPU at 100% load for 30 minutes using Cinebench R23, then recorded both the max temp reached and the average temp throughout the test. First, the stock, which hit a max temp of 68 degrees with an average of 64.5 degrees. Nothing spectacular, but a decent performance from the stock cooler. Certainly nothing which would worry the CPU. On to the AK500, which, spoiler alert, dominated the stock cooler. The AK500 had a high of only 48 degrees and an average of 47 degrees. So that's a 20 degree difference in high temps against a stock cooler and a 17 degree difference in average temps in favor of the AK500. Put another way, the AK500 was roughly around 40 to 45% colder than the stock. For these tests, we don't usually report anymore the low temps but in this case, the variance is also noteworthy. Lowest temp of the stock cooler was 40 degrees. The lowest of the AK500 was only 26 degrees. Aesthetically very similar to the other models in the AK series as well as the AG series. No nonsense yung aesthetic nitong particular models si Deep Cool. If you're looking for RGB, wala tong RGB. If you're looking for RGB, you might want to consider the AS500 Plus or other models. The aesthetic is okay. I mean, I like the front cover of the tower, but yun nga, it's very business-like, mas muted siya, hindi siya yung tipong look at me kind of cooler. These results imply that the AK500 could handle much hotter CPUs and we're thinking of testing it out more in the future, time and stocks permitting. We're giving the AK500 4 out of 5 candies, no-nonsense looking cooler, and talagang no-nonsense rin yung performance. SRP is 55 US. If the local prices keep in line with this, then you will be getting a good return on your money. Paminsan, may nagtatanong kung may kilala ba kaming computer shop na trusted, yung hindi ka lolokohin. Actually, meron. Kami. Full service PC store ang Hardware Sugar. Nagbabenta kami ng PC components. Nagbabenta rin kami ng fully assembled rigs. We clean computers. Kasama na rin yung excellent cable management namin and CPU cooler repasting sa cleaning. We also clean and repaste GPUs. Nasa Makati yung physical store namin and you can also buy from our site www.hwsugar.ph na 100% palaging up-to-date yung inventory dun. Kung in-stock yung item sa amin, available yun sa site. We also ship nationwide. Thanks for watching and maybe one of these days, magkita tayo sa shop.